Hi again. In this tutorial, I like to talk about the heat pumps for the ventilation system. It's like the same that you did last year on second semester where you had a heat pump for the radiator system and for the underfloor uh, heating system. <clears throat> this year, you also need to have a pump for the ventilation system that you have in the building. So if we go to the program, then we have the first uh, table here, which is automatically filled out when we fill out the table about the pump. So if we jump to that, <clears throat> here you can see we need to uh, have the ventilation um, system put in because we have a pump there. And the reason for it is that we need to mix uh, the, um, uh, the heat uh, going into the radiator that we have in the ventilation system to heat up the air coming into the building from the returning heat that we have uh, from the ventilation unit. <clears throat> and we can use the same sketch that we had last year, uh, where we can see here we have the incoming um, heat coming in. And if this is not a radiator system, but a ventilation system instead, and then we have the returning heat, then then it might not have been gone down to these 40 degrees. So, so we need to use the heat again, and therefore we have a pump uh, here. <clears throat> so therefore we fill it out, and then we need to tell what kind of uh, system it is and how many pumps we have. Same thing as last year, the uh, energy is using and then the reduction factor that we have from the SBI is 0.4. It is more or less the same as we had last year. So if you, if you can't recall how it is, then look back to the tutorials that you had from second semester. Now I like you to go to the assignment uh, that we have. Uh, go in to the heat uh, part and see uh, what it is for the heat uh, for the ventilation system and fill it out in the assignment. See you in the next tutorial.